Mr. Minto, have a historic moment to open the new building of the Embassy of the Republic of Armenia on St. James 31. It's a great honor to invite the Minister of Foreign Affairs of the Republic of Armenia, His Excellency Ararat Mirzoyan, to raise the flag above this building. Mr. Minister, please feel free to raise the flag. Minister, please, if you want to take it, change it. Please, <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Your Excellency, Minister Mirzoyan, Your Excellency, Minister Minto, Your Grace, Bishop of Agim, Marshal of Diplomatic Corps, Mr. Harrison, Vice Marshal, Victoria Busby, ladies and gentlemen, allow us to welcome all of you warmly at this wonderful building here. And just a couple of minutes ago, we did the official ceremony of historic importance for Armenia-UK relations to raise the flag. His Excellency Minister did it under the sounds of the anthem of the Republic of Armenia and the United Kingdom. We are very much delighted to welcome you at our new house to finally, after such a long journey of 30 years, and I wanted to also thank our UK-Armenian community for hosting us for 30 years in the previous building, which was the appropriate building for previous phase of our history. But now it's time to move on for Armenia to have a decent representation to this building. The main purpose of this building is going to be strengthen our bilateral relations. And that's our mission for our diplomatic team here and Mr. Minister, I would like to invite you to share your thoughts and your words with us to be followed by Mr. Minto. Thank you. Can I ask? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, um, Your Excellency, Minister Minto, Your Grace, Excellencies, uh, ladies and gentlemen, dear guests, it is with um, great pleasure and uh, sense of profound honor that we gather here today to celebrate the opening of the new embassy of Republic of Armenia in London. Uh, this embassy stands uh, as a beacon of friendship and cooperation between our nations. And uh, this building is a bridge that connects not only our governments, but also our economies, our cultures, uh, and our peoples. Uh, as we cut ribbon today, we not only open a building, but lay a new foundation for deepening our relations. We are reaffirming our commitments to deepen our political dialogue, our economic ties, our uh, cultures, cultural ties. Uh, but also, um, it is an interesting uh, coincidence that immediately after this opening ceremony, we are going to launch a new level in our bilateral relations we're going to launch a strategic dialogue between Republic of Armenia and the United Kingdom. So uh, it is my pleasure to share this historic moment with you today, uh, dear guests, in this historic building in the heart of uh, London, 
and um, thank you for being part of this historic moment. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. And now I would like to invite uh, Minister Timothy Minter of the Department of International Business and Trade. Mr. Minister, you have the floor, please. Thank you, Your Excellency, Your Grace, for your kind words. I'm very pleased to stand alongside you today to formally open your new embassy building right at the heart of London, as you said. This embassy building, your visit to London, and my colleague, the Minister of Europe's visit to Yerevan next week, all clearly demonstrate the growing ties between our two countries. I saw this myself only a few weeks ago when I welcomed Armenian officials and businesses to London for the UK Armenia Business Forum. This was an excellent opportunity for UK businesses to hear about the wide range of trade and investment opportunities across multiple sectors in Armenia, in particular infrastructure, energy and IT fintech. After the forum, I met with your colleague, the Minister for uh, the Economy, Minister Karobian, alongside your very hard-working and outstanding ambassador and was impressed by your government's ambition to expand uh, our cooperation. I trust that the discussions you have later today with foreign office ministers will be just as productive. With our shared democratic values and in the face of shared threats, there is much more we can achieve together and this new embassy building will be central in achieving that. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs>